With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello guys, so the given question says, consider the reaction and the heat change for this reaction given as minus 111 kilojoule. If N2O5 solid is formed instead of N2O5 gas, in the above reaction, the heat change value will be. And here given that delta H of sublimation for N2O5 is 54 kilojoule per mole. Now, here given that 4NO2 gas plus O2, which is also in gas state, gives 2N2O5 gas and the heat change for this reaction given as minus 111 kilo joule and here also given that heat of sublimation of N2O5 which means the N2O5 solid changes into N2O5 gas and heat change for this step is given as 54 kilojoule per mole. Here 2 moles of N2O5 forms so here also 2 moles. Now we have to determine the heat change of this process. Let's say this is delta Rh dash. Now, according to Hess law, if any process happened in the steps, so the heat change of the particular process is the sum of heat change of the all the steps involved, which means the heat change of this process will be equal to sum of the heat changes of steps that is this step and this steps involved. So we can write delta Rh is equal to the delta H of sublimation plus delta H of reaction dash. So now we get delta Rh dash will be equal to delta Rh minus delta H sublimation. So here given that delta R is minus 111 kilojoule minus delta H of sublimation given as 54 kilojoule. So by calculating this value we get delta R H is equal to the minus 165 kilojoule which is our required heat change of here dash. So, which is our required heat change of the given process. So, the correct option is option number 1 and all other options are incorrect. I hope you understand. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.